The Puerto Rican Senate has filed a lawsuit aiming to remove newly appointed Governor Pedro Pierluisi on constitutional grounds. On Monday, the island Supreme Court agreed to vote on the suit and gave all parties until Tuesday to file their paperwork. Pierre Luis was appointed Secretary of State by former Governor Ricardo Rosseo, who resigned Friday amid controversy over offensive group chat messages. The island's House of Representatives confirmed Pierre Luis as Rosseo's replacement on Friday in a 26 to 21 vote. The Senate was expected to vote on his confirmation Monday, but Pierre Luis's promotion was expedited based on Puerto Rico's constitution and a 2005 law that says a Secretary of State does not have to have both chambers' approval to step in as governor. The Senate's lawsuit asked the High Court to declare that 2005 law unconstitutional, which would void Pierre Luis's confirmation. It also wants a preliminary injunction ordering Pierre Luis to cease his functions as governor immediately. The Senate says Pierre Luisi's swearing in was invalid because he didn't fully take over the Secretary of State position before Rosseo resigned. But Pierre Luisi stands by the law and says since the House and Senate were in recess at the time, his swearing in as Secretary of State was legal. He said in a statement on Monday, quote, With the utmost deference to the Supreme Court of Puerto Rico, I will wait for its decision, trusting that what is best for Puerto Rico will prevail. Former Secretary of State Luis Rivera Marin stepped down on July 13th as he was linked to the same group chat controversy as Rosseo. Justice Secretary Wanda Vazquez was next in line to take Marin's place, but she didn't want the job. So Pierre Luis was confirmed as a new Secretary of State last month. Pierre Luisi formally gave legal advice to the federally created board supervising Puerto Rico's finances, including its bankruptcy cases. That's made his promotion controversial and unpopular.